What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to this quick and easy under the wall free kick tutorial. A lot of people asking me about this. It's very simple and it looks nice and it can confuse and catch out your opponent. So if you do get a lot of free kicks, you need to be punishing, right? So the first step is to aim between two defenders. These are the defenders that are going to jump more often than not. So you're going to just try and aim it in between the defender's legs um, and also in between the, the post. So obviously a right footer is going to curl it on the inside of the post, a left footer is going to curl it on the outside there. So it just flips with the tutorial here. But we're going to just barely tap the shoot button. This is the main key ingredient in this recipe, lads, and in this tutorial. Tap the shoot button, like I mean barely tap it. Once you start running, you're just going to be holding down kind of this, this kind of direction here down left or left down and then obviously the power is going to dictate the height of the free kick more than anything so once you get the height right you don't even really need to aim um, you can just put a little bit of a, a swerve on it to make it a little bit more difficult for the goalkeeper and this also helps when the wall doesn't uh, jump fully as we'll see here in a second but you can see here that the wall one of the players jumps kind of late when we slow it down there and this can kind of happen depending you know some of the players don't jump you'll see here the middleman doesn't jump so if you have just aimed in a straight line here instead of a curl you're not going to clear the wall right so it is a nice tool to have in your arsenal lads I, ge I genuinely try and use this every now and again especially if you're playing against a good opponent it does only work at certain distances though right you can't really use it too far away from goal because the keeper will save it um as you can see there, if there's not enough power in it, and if there's too much power, it'll go too high. And also, if it's too close, sometimes it won't clear the wall because they won't have a chance to fully jump. But that is it. It's very quick and easy. Basically, all you have to look at is kind of uh, taking the power, just a little tap, see where it is on the gauge, maybe 5% on the gauge, clear it, and have a nice little trick up your sleeve. So that's it for me, lads. I'll be back later. Don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed it. Peace.